Hello Brawlers, it's Hyper Time Minotaur here again with the first unboxing of 2021, or my first unboxing of 2021. I'm constantly messing up my lines here. So today, we are going to be taking a look at two all new Bakugan from Bakugan Geogon Rising, the new series for 2021. So, the Bakugan in question we're going to take a look at are Arcleon and Viperagon. So here you can take a look at the boxes here. And here are the backs of the boxes. And I know what you're probably thinking. Hyper, these aren't Bakugan, they're non-spherical. We'll get to that later. Let's just open them up already. So before we get onto the unboxing, it's time for a brief history lesson. So these guys, which are called Geogon, are inspired by Bakugan traps from the original series. If you don't know what Bakugan traps were, well, like Geogon, they were basically non-spherical Bakugan. And uh, basically how you would play them, you would drop them onto the field and they would change your Bakugan's attribute. While Geogon here are played differently. And basically traps toys are required to play the game. And also, which is concerning to some fans, because while well, Geogon are required to play the game and more plastic is what kind of killed the original game, unfortunately. So they're a little worried that Spin Master might keep up the trend of using more plastic, unlike Baku Gear from last year, which didn't require the toy to play. But anyway, traps were my favorite gimmick when I was little. I didn't play the games, I would play with these guys more like little action figures, to be honest. And I thought these guys were really, really cool looking because, well, they were so different and new. And yeah, that kind of wraps up this uh, brief, terribly explained... Uh, a uh, brief history lesson. Now let's just get on to the unboxing. So the first Geogon we're going to be taking a look at is Arcelion. So here is the card it comes with. String Strike, depicting Arcelion on it. Gives you plus two, or requires two energy points to play. Gives you 400 Bs. Here is his quote-unquote character card, which Geogon cards are actually played like action cards. Requires one energy to play. Gives, uh, he has 900 Bs, does 2 damage, and gives you a double strike when he opens. And judging from the art, he is this manticore-like creature, and I really like the crystals on the Geogon. Really beautiful and all that jazz, and uh, just look how badass he is. Pretty cool looking. Just take the time to admire the art here. Alright, art admiring his time is up. <laughs> here is the like, gate card it comes with. Gives you uh, plus 700 Bs if your Bakugan is Pyrus. Aquos Bakugan get minus 200 Bs. Ventus Bakugan get 700 Bs. Heos Bakugan get minus 200 Bs. Aurelis Bakugan get plus uh, 700 Bs. And Darkest Bakugan finally get minus 200 Bs. And here is Lad himself, Arcelion, in his uh, ball form, or I mean cube form. <laughs> it's a full 360 of him. And Geogon also have little holes where you can put Baku gear in, which is pretty neat. Makes them compatible with it. Also, this little arrow thing points to you which way the Geogon opens. So let's open up Arcelion right now. And when you're playing Geogon, uh, I think I already stated this maybe, they're required to be uh, dropped from one card length away vertically, and which has some fans concern because they don't want to break their Geogon when they're playing the game. So I'll just uh, open them like this. Didn't open completely. <laughs> kind of stupid, but who cares? Here he is, and he is pretty chubby and pretty cute. I love his little tiny horns and head. <laughs> He's got uh, several points of articulation. His tail, his wings, head, horn, forelegs and hind legs and i really love the translucent pl plastic on these guys makes them stand out really good and cool like i said he is 900 bees let's get a better view of that uh stupid lighting there we go 900 bees okay sorry pull them back up put his little head down his little legs up or actually i think you Oops, I need to fix that. Put his little legs up. Put his head down. Put the four legs here. Put the, fold in the four legs. Fold in the tail. Then finally fold in the wings. There we go. 
Arcelion is back in his cube form. And that's, uh, well, Arcelion for ya. So the next and final Geogon we're gonna be taking a look at is Viperagon. Here are the cards it comes with. Sonic Scream, which requires 5 energy to play, and gives you plus 10 damage points and a search effect. And here is his uh, quote-unquote character card again. Viperagon, which requires uh, 2 energy to play. It has 500 bees and does 10 damage. And if you land on a shield, you get plus 1,000 bees and minus 5 damage points. And uh, judging by his appearance, he's supposed to be some sort of Amphisabina type or however you type creature, however you pronounce that. He's uh, both Viper and Dragon, and yeah, he's really cool looking. And also, here's his gate card comes with. It gives you minus 200 bees for Bakugan's Pyrus, plus 700 bees for Bakugan's Aquos, plus 700 bees if you're Bakugan is Ventus, minus 200 bees if you're Bakugan is Chaos, plus 700 bees if you're Bakugan is Aurelis, and minus 200 bees if you're Bakugan is Darkus. So let's now open up this uh, drum-shaped guy. So here's a look at him first. I really love the matte painting on the Geogon in Year 3 Bakugan. It's really, really cool looking. Shows that Spin Master kind of cares about their product design. I also really like the neon translucent green on this guy. So here he is. And get a load of them. He's got multiple points of articulation. His uh, back, his head, his wings, his tail joints, or his tail, or snake part of him, and the little tiny head right here. And just, wow, this guy is amazing, and he has 500 bees. He just looks so, so cool. And just like I said, he is an Amphisabena type creature. And yeah, I really love the little two heads on this guy. And also I have him in Aquas variation. Let me get him right now. Here is him in the Aquas variation. And yeah. Those are my two Viperagons. Well, that's all really I can show about Arcelion and Viperagon today. Hope you enjoyed this unboxing, Brawlers. Remember to leave a like, drop a comment, if you're nice enough, subscribe to this channel for more Bakugan content. I'm Hyper Tyranitar, signing off.